Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to episode number 72 of my level up series with Hashtag United, uh, taking Hashtag United through the levels of the football environment. Before we get into today's video though, I'd really appreciate it if you're new to the channel to hit the subscribe button down below if you're interested in daily football manager content. We're coming back with a bang. I'm actually somehow going to be um, hitting back to back videos, <laughs> would you believe, for the first time in about a week. Um, so yeah, coming back strong, really motivated, really positive about how things are going with the series um, and with the game itself. I'm really enjoying playing it at the moment. You know, we're getting into the really important parts. Um, well, the last half, in theory, you know, of the of the series. You know, we've already made it halfway from where we started to to now to uh, League League Two. So anyway. I'll run you through some of the stuff that's been going on. Um, where to start? Finances are looking terrible. We had that massive lump of cash, 212 grand. That's disintegrated um, within the space of how many months? Three months, four months. Which is to be expected when we're spending over our budget on 22 grand a week, which is the idea. So we need some cut money coming in just to prop us up a little bit. In regards to the schedule, we've played four games, no, nope. three games since the last one we were starting off with a 2-1 win over top of the table Northampton, which was quite surprising to be honest, we played really well, um, Stuart Richardson with Brace in that game, really, really positive performance, bumped us up into third place I think with that victory which was great and then we've had two so-so performances starting off with a disappointing 3-2 defeat to Tranmere which is in again with a goal and Doug Denyer with a goal as well they they went 3-0 up as well just yeah it wasn't a good performance by us to be honest um, they fully deserved to win the game don't get me wrong very very good in front of goal they, they were some good strikes in there good goals for them so fair play to them and then Accrington was the last game where we drew 1-1 coming from behind after uh, Anthony Cameron putting one nil up and then we replied within five minutes we threw uh, Jazz Middleton and the game settled down and then we, we we were searching towards the end of the game we weren't attacking and we had some good opportunities but they just couldn't find a way in unfortunately so it's not really had too much of an effect on the league table I mean we're sitting in fourth so we're a little bit higher higher up on the table um, but as you can see, all the teams around us have only lost one, but fortunately we've only drawn one, so we've managed to win games, which is kind of keeping us up there um, in this playoff spot at the moment. Obviously it's still early doors though, and everyone's very bunched together points-wise. So firstly then, our first port of call is against Leighton Orient. Now we want to get revenge on them for that kind of shock defeat, really. Well, not shock defeat, a disappointing defeat. In the end, when we conceded them two late goals in the extra time in the um, leasing trophy, or the Johnson, I'm just going to call it Johnson's Paint Trophy because everyone knows who's watching will know it as the Johnson's Paint Trophy as well. So, yeah, um, yeah, we lost that game. So, we want to kind of get a bit of revenge, and then we've obviously got the big game against West Ham in the Carabao third, Cup third round, which is sick. And if, you know, I mean, we would have liked it. The, Olympic Stadium just because for the gate receipts but either way it's going to be a great game like we've, I don't think we've played a Premier League team in a competitive competitive game not that I can think of no yeah we've not so this, these will be the first guys uh, the Hammers so it's going to be really fun and yeah without further ado let's get to the let's get some revenge against the Leighton Orient right and do, 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 play the 4 2 3 one. let's just quick pick Teams not looking too bad. I'm going to play Richardson. I want to get the win in this game. Peter Jones is having a, not much of a convincing time of things in midfield, but Perix looking quite tired, so he needs to be rested. Reynolds is in, but I'm thinking Nolan. I think if City could go as well. Back from injury, so we probably won't risk him. 
Right, we're going to have to go with this team and hope that it's going to be enough. Which it should, because we, from what I remember in that late and orient game, in the last episode, we, we played really well against them, so I'm going to expect we're going to do the same thing again, being at home as well, although our form's dipped a little bit, but we can beat them, I know we can beat them, we have got the beating of them, cause which we've proved even though that lack of concentration late on cost us daily, but Unfortunately, it was only in the Johnson's Paint Trophy, so it's not the biggest of deals because it's not something that I'm really focusing on. I'm not bothered if we get knocked out in the group stages, to be honest. There's no kind of skin off my nose at this point. We need to just establish ourselves within the league this season and then hopefully push on then and then we can maybe down the line, either that, whether that be in League 2 or in League 1, kind of press in to try and win that Johnson's Paint Trophy at some point. We got the ball though. Anderson tees it off to uh, Richards. Denya tries to ping the ball across, switch the play. Don't quite make it though, but we do still keep possession. Anderson can put a good ball in. Can he find one? He does. Oh, Middleton's unlucky. Johnson. Shots blocked. Shots blocked. It's unlucky. Richards on again. Ooh, nice. Kill up. Alright, All right, fine. Fine. Kill up, Richards. Take another corner, I suppose. Why not? We've had five corners in the space of 14 minutes. <laughs> I've not really done anything with him. Let's just say that in Middleton. He's pretty good in the air, it seems. I don't even know how tall he is. I don't think he's that tall. I think he's like maybe average height, like 5'11 or something. But the guy, the guy's a an aerial threat, like just like Johnson, to be fair, off that right hand side, which is decent. Richards! Oh, that's unlucky. Again, though, dominating them with um, highlights. But we need to get that goal as well. Let's have a look. He's six foot one, so he's pretty tall, to be fair. Same height as me. Jumping reach isn't that good. Well, it's, deep, it's solid at 13, don't get me wrong, but. It's nothing outstanding, isn't it? Like, Richards is 11. Oh, my God. Keeper. Jones is on a man there. What are you doing? What the hell is going on? Let's not make silly mistakes, please. I'm gonna go attacking, I don't even care. We've got the beating of these today, I can tell. So we need to just punish them and make sure that that becomes a reality. I'm confident, I'm confident in the boys. Not when they're making silly mistakes like that though, that nearly cost us. Come on. Really? Brilliant. <laughs> Come on, we need a better second half here. All them shots we've had, and we've managed one half chance. That's pretty poor. I mean, they've had no half chances, no clear cuts, and managed to score a goal. So, disappointing first half, to be honest. After we started really brightly. Jones with the mistake, to be honest. Middleton, nice, finds Richardson. Yes, let's go, Stuart Richardson. Goal number five of the season. 
through the legs of a bird. Very, very nice. But and just times times the run right. Well, Richardson times the runs right. Mother and times the pass right. <laughs> Waits it perfectly. Very very solid. I'm I'm pleased with Richardson. He's really he's really coming alive now. You know at the start of the season he was, you know obviously didn't score for a few games. But he's he, he's coming alive, man. What the hell, Nolan? Poor defending, so poor. Oh my god! How how's he scored that? He should not be scoring goals like that. Just when I think we're gonna get back into the game. Come on, Jones, what can you do with it? <laughs> Alright, nice, but Nolan pinged the ball to Daniel there. Decent. Ah, oh, gets dispossessed though, come on! Oh no, it's not looking good. We'll take it. And we can't do anything. We can't count, I know nothing. Anderson, oh come on Johnson, that's your sort of ball that normally, Someone's got to happen. How many flipping highlights are we going to have? For, you know what I mean? Jeez. It's no good. No good. Richards. Let's go. Let's go. Middle end. Yes. Come on. Yes. Let's go. Fully deserved. Fully deserved. Great ball by Richards there. Bang. Fallback doesn't know where Middleton is there. Does the job. Bada boom, bada bing. I'll just leave it. No, oh, actually, no, I'm taking, I'm, ta I'm taking some of these off here. Taking you off, you're having a stinker. And you, you're you know, having a good game over. Try and hold on to this 2 2, or maybe push for goal number 3. Is it going to be our day? Let's go, Richardson. Come on. You play that one across. You're going to pull it back to Middleton. Oh. <laughs> what a chance. What a chance. That ball just came across there. Ah. Uh. Defend, defend, defend. Nice, 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 Johnson. Don't do anything stupid. You mob it. You mug. Just 
a series of errors. Why? Like, why? Fucking idiots, man. Johnson, you're a fucking moron for that. Such a fucking idiot, man. Oh, God. We've been so unlucky in this game. Seriously unlucky. Poor, well, not unlucky. It's not unlucky. How can it be unlucky? It's just poor defending, like... Full time, 3 2 Leighton Orient. Richard to the middle in for the goals for us. And we've been done over by him again, yet again. I can't believe it, to be honest. That's kind of pissed me off, I'm not gonna lie. Right. Hmm. I would drop down out of the playoffs now, but you know, it is what it is, I suppose. It's can't expect to be. Challenging for playoffs, really, in our first season, but that's disappointing. We should have got a point from that game at least. It's just awful, awful goals we conceded in that game. Um, yeah, I guess we're just gonna have to see how we can get on against West Ham because it's gonna be extremely tough. But we are at home, which gives us a bit of a well, the slimmest, the slimmest of hope that we might somehow pull off a huge upset. But I'll be back for that game in like two seconds. Here we go then. The day we've all been waiting for against West Ham. We've got a capacity crowd as well, which is amazing. Um, we're definitely not playing that. We're playing a 4-3-3. Um, and then... Oh my God, how many yellow cards do you need? Jesus Christ. Thing's gonna have to come in and do a job. The the old faithful, <laughs> good old Sam just coming in, filling in when needed. <laughs> Zinchenko, I know him. Will Hughes, Lerma, Amati, Rafael Guerrero, Diaz. I don't know this guy. I don't know this guy. I don't know this guy. Let's have a look at that lead. Whoa, damn. Yep. I thought they might be going easy on us, but, uh, you know, maybe playing a few more of the kids, but apparently not. Apparently not. Jesus Christ. Okay. This could be tough. I'm going to stay positive, though. If we can get a replay. Oh yeah, I didn't think about that. Oh no, actually, you don't have Carabao Cup. Do you have replays? I'm trying to think. I'm not sure you do. Have replays on a Carabao Cup? It'd be good if you do. Maybe you should. No, you don't, do you? I'm doubting myself. Now. I don't think you do. I believe that we should get some decent, a decent gate from from this game for sure. We got a decent gate from the last uh, game against Leighton Orient, where we got like two thousand, two and a half thousand. So and this is like double that. So we are rolling in the money, man. We are rolling in the money. Easy, easy. <sighs> the other was tearing us a new one. Defend for your lives, boys. For your lives. Let's have a look at the goalkeeper. He's got to be a uh, uh, 21 mil. Ah, uh, Jesus. Mavra. Panos. Paolo Diaz. Damn. Will Hughes is 31, mad. <laughs> Oof, come on. Oh, Paolo. That was a chance. That was a great chance. That was a great chance. <laughs> Jones, let's go. Mm. 
We're putting up a solid, solid fight here, to be fair. And you're an absolute idiot in games like this. Do not give away cheap goals like that, like this. But this is not what we needed. Joke. Bellow, you're a joke, mate. You're a joke. Come on, Middleton. Oof. What the hell? That, what? What? I went in, mate. What? At least we're giving them a game, why not, you know what I mean? <laughs> go out on your shields, and That's what it's about. Might as well give it a go rather than being defensive and then just getting picked apart. Because that's what will happen if we go defensive. <sighs> oh, Jesus. Living, living life on the edge right now. Middleton's looking knackered, you know. He's gonna have to get taken off. He's not having a good game either, to be fair, so. Bang, you're off. Bang, you're off. No, no not many people are having a good game, really, are they? Let's be honest. Reynolds. All day. Triple sub. Bit of a risk, <laughs> to be fair, but. Gotta go for it, innit? Defend this, defend it. What's what's Johnson mate? You're giving away too many causing too many cheap errors. Good tackle though. Ah. Ah. It's over. It's over. We ain't getting back into this now. No chance. This could be the water, water gate, um, floodgates opening. Oh, we got a lifeline. Thompson, out of nowhere. You get a penny. Come on, Thompson. Let's go! Gets one back for us from the penalty spot. Only his second goal of the season, which I think again was from the penalty spot. But fair play to the guy. <laughs> Not had much game time. Took it well. Sent the keeper the wrong way. Well, all I've got to say is let's go for it now. At least the wrong has been. Scratched off. The fact that they got that penalty. We've managed to get one back. So I'll take that at least. So that would have been the de determining factor. I would have been pissed. Because fucking Bellow's a fucking idiot. Stupid for giving away a penalty like that. Jonesy. What can you do, my son? 
Set T off to Bellow. Anderson. <laughs> Into Denya now. Could this be our highlight? Surely not. Anderson. Ooh, ooh it's going to get tackled. Nah. Oh dear. Oh dear, we're in trouble. All out of position. And, yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Solid save by Jones. Do it, Richardson. Turn your man. Go on. Ah. Why not? Why not? He's got the confidence. You might as well have a crack. Jesus Christ. Leave him for dead. Leave him for dead. Left him for dead. Oh, yes, Jones, come on. My man's having a fucking belter of a game in, in between the sticks. Um, I mean, we can't even make any subs, can we, so... Ooh. It's alright. We don't need a striker. Just bring four nails on casually. You know, just casual bring four nails on. Yeah, it's just four nails, isn't it? Then you go on, my son. No, surely not. Surely not. No. <laughs> oh god, if we would have scored that, if we just would have buried that, <laughs> that would have been unreal, but not to be. To be fair, looking at stats, we've not done too bad actually, if you compare. I mean, yeah, we've been smashed over by possession, but clear cuts and half chances is pretty close. So, uh, yep. Yeah. Disappointing, obviously, <laughs> but you know you got to be realistic about these things. To be honest, like it was really, really slim chances we were going to win that game. We are not tall, but we had a good little run to the third round. That's pretty impressive, I think. I'll I, I didn't expect us to get that far. Simon Thompson is, jeez, knee ligaments. Um, let's have a look at finances. Damn, damn, that's not even helped to finances that much. We're just negative that much. <laughs> three thousand plus three thousand this month. That's woeful. But let's have a look when we're gonna come back. I'm gonna come back obviously in October time. We'll skip this Northampton game. Not bothered. Um, who have we got? Who we can play? Go for a bit of Cambridge and Fleetwood at the end of the, at the end of the um, month. Why not? That sounds like a good time to come back, and I've got a good run of games that I can just get my teeth into in the meantime. So if you enjoyed today's video, I really appreciate it. If you would hit the like button, dislike it if you disliked it, comment if you want, comment on it, subscribe if you want, subscribe. Thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in episode number seventy-three. Cheers. Bye bye.